And welcome back to another video of Trial by Fire with me, Scott Andrews, your host. Uh, this week we're going to be doing something uh, similar to what I've done before. In the past, I've done the Cheetos Mac and Cheese Flamin' Hot. This time I'm going to do the Cheetos Mac and Cheese Jalapeno. Or Cheesy Jalapeno, technically. Um, give this a try and see how it goes. Hopefully it's not too bad. Uh, gotta love some jalapeno, especially with some cheese. It's great together. Um, but before we uh, actually get that unveiled and tried, don't forget to uh, check out our social media up here and the tags will be below with all the infos up here. And just want to thank you again for coming in and checking out the videos. Uh, if you haven't subscribed, please subscribe. If you uh, already have, thank you very much. Thumbs up to you. Trying to get the subscriber account up. Um, yeah, right here, comment, subscribe, link, bell, all the info up here. Do what you need to do. You know what to do with all these videos. You've been watching them around. They've been around long enough. It's not telling you anything you don't already know. But, but yeah, please subscribe. And uh, we'll be back in a moment with uh, the food to try it out. Okay, well, we're back. And so I made up the uh, jalapeno, cheesy jalapeno. And it smells like when you open a fresh bottle of queso sauce. The jalapeno is really good. Now... Here is the noodles. Now, I will tell you, the, the noodles are not green. The uh, cheese is not green. I did that simply because these ones here were so red, I just wanted a nice comparison. So I put some green food dye in to just spice it up a little, make it a little more jalapeno. So anyways, what we got about here on the box is the directions, obviously, how to make it, whatnot. Um, Cheesy mac and cheese with Chester Cheetah on it. They've got uh, information on the side, all that kind of stuff. Actually, there's a barcode there. I don't know. Or a QR code. I don't know what. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, I don't know. I guess it won't scan properly. Um, they got in the bottom of the box here. Also, try creating a Max, a Mac mix. Mix up your mac by adding your own Cheetos crunchy or puffs topping. And then hashtag it at Cheetos Mac Snack. Or Cheetos, yeah, Mac Chat, Mac Hack, sorry. I didn't even see, yeah, it's on the other one too, I didn't even see that. So, anyway, so here goes, going to eat the wonderful green, and I'm sure the ins my insides are going to love this. Green jalapeno craft dinner or mac and cheese. Oh, that is delicious. It's just got just the right amount of heat. Like, I'm not even sure how to describe it. It definitely has a jalapeno taste. It's not overpowering, it's just the right level. At least for me. It might be overpowerful for somebody else. You never know. But for me, it's oh, it's just so nice. I was worried that it would be kind of low. So I was going to add in, I have jalapeno garlic. Um, garlic is good on anything too. But jalapeno garlic, even better with a jalapeno uh, flavored uh, mac and cheese. So I figured, why not? But I didn't need, to. I don't need to. It's just, it's good. Um, Cheetos, mac and cheese. If you're watching this and you want to sponsor me, go right ahead. This stuff, I love the flaming Hot. The cheesy jalapeno is amazing. I ha can't find these ones, the box of the, the, box of the uh, jalapeno anywhere. I can find the little individual ones. But I have a few more boxes of the flaming. so thankfully. Whew. Um, they were hard to come by in the first place. But oh yeah, this is absolutely divine. Hmm. A little on the hot side for temperature wise at the moment fresh out of the pot <laughs> oh this is so good I could eat this for days mm. and the color just suits it it works perfectly <laughs> but um yeah definitely if you're if you like jalapenos try it it's uh, like I said it's a nice flavor. It's not in your face. Um, when you make it, the, t the cheese powder is typical of your 
no more mac and cheese boxes, um, neon orange, more or less, which, um, of course, we all know is the natural color of cheese. Uh, <laughs> so, yeah, when you uh, do that, it, it comes out fine. That's why I kind of added this coloring to do it. Mind you, I was adding the coloring before I added the cheese, before I even looked at it, because I had a feeling it was just going to be normal cheese with some jalapeno flavor to it. Um, yeah, definitely get it if you're, if you got the chance to and you like jalapeno, go for it. It's, uh, like most mac and cheese, not the healthiest thing for you. Especially when you eat a whole box. Uh, what gets me is they say two to five servings for a box. Who are you feeding? Like, are they munchkins? Are they got the stomach of a, an ant? I'm sorry, but okay, I'm not a small guy, but come on. <laughs> like, like this literally one bowl is half the box of what and I still got one more bowl left. That's two two bowls. And they're not big bowls, as you can tell. They're not very like what? If I do a box, they're about half the box and uh level of height of noodles on the side, as it indicates there. But yeah, it's I don't know. I don't know who they're serving, like I said. Mmm. Mmm, so good. I so wish I had picked up more of these. I'll have to get some of the uh, individual ones, if I can get them at a cheaper price there. This particular one was $2.79 for a box. Full box. The place I found them, charging $2.99 for an individual serving. I think I'll try and see if I can get them on sale or something. Or if I can find them somewhere else. Or if somebody knows where I can get them online, leave me a message. Because they are good. <laughs> um, yeah. So, jalapeno, cheesy jalapeno, Cheetos, mac and cheese. Definite pickup for anybody who's got a nice, uh, like, you know, jalapeno flavor. Um, mm, mm. I can't stress how much, how good this is. I wish you guys could smell it. Send the smell over the internet. Through the YouTube to you. smell a vision uh, It just smells amazing. Tastes amazing. Um, of all the things I've tried so far, there hasn't been anything that, like, that's that been good as in the sense of you got the great temperature for what it is and the flavor too. So it's really hard to come across that. Right now, I just found it. I'm sure I'll find it again, and I'm sure I've, found, I've probably had it in the past, but as for the videos, this is the first thing that's truly, truly grabbed my taste buds in the sense of what it is. It's jalapeno. It tastes like jalapeno. It's not in your face jalapeno to be a hot jalapeno. It's not, oh, here's a little touch of jalapeno. It's just right. It's like, the much I've cooked with jalapenos in the mac and cheese. They balance that really well. Mm. Sorry about that. <laughs> but yeah, if you can have, like I said, the fiery ones, I'll link below for the video for that one if you haven't watched it already. And <clears throat> yeah, it's just, the fiery ones were good. They were hot. Like not in your face hot, but they were hot. Um, didn't need anything extra added to them. They were quite well taste flavored in the heat sec uh, portion. Taste wise, eh, more or less tasted like craft uh, dinner, KD, mac and cheese, whatever you want to call it. Noodles and sauce. Uh, <laughs> but yeah, the, this one, this has a real nice flavor. And I wouldn't have actually have had them at all if it hadn't been for my sister who let me know that they were actually a thing at the store. So I want to th uh, throw out to Terry. Thank you for this. And uh, yeah, if you haven't tried this one, I, know, I thought you said you picked it up. Try it. It's good. But yeah, so that's pretty much it for this one. Just uh, keeping it uh, as real as I can, eating and enjoying the food. Once again, our social media or my social media tags and everything up here. Uh, do the you know, subscribe and comment uh, links below and click if you haven't subscribed. If you have, great. 
Always good to have you on board. So let your friends know if they want to, if they're interested in watching and want to add some more content to their pages to view. But yeah, other than that, I just want to say have a great one and enjoy the heat and stay spicy. Well, just a side note, I ate both bowls. I ate the whole box. It was actually that good. <laughs> Don't forget to follow, like, share, subscribe, and notify for on all social media.